Good day and welcome to an overview of ParkTrack Pro software. ParkTrack Pro, in conjunction with our handheld units, offers valuable tools such as license plate recognition, digital imaging, and barcode recognition. These tools enable real-world parking solutions like electronic tire chalking, photo notes, and virtual or barcode permit management. The ParkTrack Pro software combines off-the-shelf components with advanced platform configurable modules, which easily integrate with third-party applications. ParkTrack's third-party partners include industry leaders in the field of pay on foot and pay by sale technologies, web services, accounting, and intelligent voice recognition. With this integration, you can reduce your enforcement costs, improve your collections, and best of all, simplify your management. Let's take a look at the PC software application which syncs with our handheld units. It's quick and easy to view all tickets by taking a look at the Explorer view of all files included in the database. Every violation which is synced with our PC application can be viewed by a simple click. Let's just take a look at this one violation and we can see that we have different tabs on the violation fields. We see all of the notice information, any of the transactions that have been performed, any activity on the account, any letters that have been generated. We also have the ability to take four images and save them as JPEG files. Should there be any objection to the violation through the adjudication process. Owner information can easily be found as well since ParkTrack Pro integrates with most divisions of motor vehicles. I'm going to go ahead and close this and I'm going to close the Explorer view of all files and I'm going to move on to our setup menu. Now a lot of the setup information is done in-house through our pre easy pre-install paperwork. However, through the levels of security, we can define users and what they're able to do simply by clicking on the setup menu and selecting operators and users. So let's take a look at the first one, Liliopal. Liliopal has a unique password, which can be user defined or we can assign it for that person. Now Lily is able to perform all of these tasks now let's go down to Burks. Now Burks is only allowed to set up updates. Now Taylor, Taylor has the ability to do everything except for enter payments. So you see that we can define the role of every user in the system. I'm going to go up to the setup menu again and I'm going to select the lot and location information. Notice that the windows can be kept open so that we can simply move them around if you want to view something instead of closing it and opening it again. These are all of the lots that are specified in our PC application. It's not one single parking lot or parking garage that can be included in the database but can be multiple locations. Let's take a look at 200 East Spruce and we can see that the rates can be programmed in here. There are options that can be set and other tasks can be performed within this box. I'm going to go ahead and close this and I'm going to go back and I just want to point out again that we can add or update DMV information from those available states. Moving back to the setup menu Violations. Violations can be set up with all of the amounts, the base fine amounts, the payoff amounts, and the number of days to pay. The last thing that I'd like to show you under the setup menu is void reasons. Now working in the parking industry, I've seen many tickets voided. And an attendant should always have a valid reason for voiding a ticket. We always have to be careful to maximize our revenue and minimize our liability 
So by providing void reasons, we are mitigating any reason for any kind of shrinkage or theft. I'm going to go ahead and close these windows. I'm going to go into now what I feel is the most important feature of ParkTrack Pro, and that is the reporting system. We have many, many reports programmed for you, but we have over 150 reports available. Anything that you need customized, ParkTrack will do for you. These are the payment reports, quick entries, payment summaries. We can group them by amounts or we can view all payments. Moving on to the lot inventory reports, we can see all of the activity in all of our lots. And I'd like to point out that we do have a separate menu item with sub menu items for box collections. For those locations using honor boxes, these reports will give you a concise, timely summary of the activity in that location and what's going on with the honor box revenue. Employee activity reports are very, very important for any parking operator, garage, or company managing a parking location. We always want to see that we are utilizing our employees effectively and this will give you a good look into your labor analysis. We can see what the employees have been doing the entire time of their shift. Now I had the opportunity to view a report. I'm just going to go in here and I'm going to look at this activity report. Because when I viewed a report, I saw a two hour gap in one of those employees. And you start to question, well, what was that employee doing? Easy way to take a look. So I'm just going to select all of the employees here. All right, and I'm not going to select them by lot, but by employee. And I'm going to take a look in the last month and see what that employee has done. We can either preview our report on the screen, we can send it right to the printer, or we can export it in selected formats, which include Excel, rich text format, HTML, PDF, and text. I'm going ahead to cancel this and I'm going to view the report on the screen. Now, our employees really haven't had any activity during the five the time frame that I've set. However, this is the format of the report so that you will be able to view each attendant by their specific and unique ID. See how many cars and violations they have issued within a specified period of time. I'm going ahead and I'm going to close this and I'm going to jump back to the reports menu. Very, very important, the notice reports. We can go in here and we can generate a number of different reports. By selection, how many notices were issued by the employee and at what lot? We can get all of our detail we can just get a count of the total notices done. The next thing is the scofflaw report. When someone has multiple tickets that have not been paid, they are placed on what's called a scofflaw list. Now each operator is different and may deal with their scofflaws differently. Some tow, some boot, some send letters, some adjudicate. But this is your scofflaw list for repeat offenders. I hope that this overview of ParkTrack Pro has been informative and we hope that you will find our software helpful and easy to use.